how's my breath? <sighs> Is it all right? lovely friends thank you for coming back no really thank you thank you oh is that my introduction hello my lovely friends should I make that my thing don't overthink it Angela let's just move on from the crappy introduction shall we today is I don't know, it's Thursday it's Thursday today and I'm gonna have to go to the shop I've, I've been trying to avoid going to the shops because and let's just say I'm a little financially challenged at the moment. And so spending money for just like, you know, random shop spending is not readily available at the moment. It means I haven't been to Kmart for like over a week. I am going to go to the fruit shop because we only have some mandarins on our tree now. Never mind, don't ask. They're starting to finish off. So starting to finish? Is that an oxymoron? Oh, I'm so up on the language play. So I am going to go to the fruit shop and get some fruit and veg. And I'm needing slippers because my slippers started to fall apart. You know, it's not a good look when your slippers look like they've got sanitary pads coming out the back. So now all the inner lining stuff has kind of come off. They're really manky. I'm not going to show you. It's too ugly. So I'm going to go and see if I can get some cheap slippers from the warehouse because they're just around the corner from the fruit shop. And if I don't go to Kmart, then maybe I won't spend so much money. I've written a list. I must not deviate from the list. We've had a bit of weather and it rained because, you know, it is winter. But the sun is streaming in today. Isn't that lovely? I love living in a subtropical environment. However, the weather is never predictable. You never know whether it's going to rain or whether it's going to be windy or whether it's going to be sunny. Do you see what I did there? I'm using a pun, play on, play on words. Yeah, I'm just going to move this clothing rack back out onto the deck. Google, what's, what's the hat? You, you know your butt is on Patchy Bunny, you, you know? Hi. Hi, Dougal. Do you need a bath? Would you like a bath, Dougal? Would you like a bath? I know how much you love having a bath. Okay, let's get this out of the way. Helps to open the door. Oh, I was going to put it there, but there's more washing that I forgot I had. Great. Okay, and this needs to be put somewhere under the eaves I think just in case it does rain all right I'm not taking off with your car oh man my baby has socks with sandals what has everything come to oh yeah you rock those socks stop eating the dog food yeah if you could do that that'd be great yeah you're the senior member now. I'm leaving you in charge. Okay, you're in charge. Dougal, Dougal, come back. Oh my gosh, Laundry Mountain. It never goes away. I stand here and fold the washing while I supervise the kids in the bath. Brilliant. And it never goes away. And there's a random shoe. There's your truck. My baby can see this truck from his bedroom window and he gets very excited, he loves trucks. So we have to say good night to the truck every night, but in the morning it's usually gone, but it's actually here today. So he's a bit excited. Big smile on your face, yeah. Let's go. What have we got here? Bigger. Dollar sixty-nine a kg for banana, that's good. Okay, $58.41. And oh the Tamarillo was extravagant. $8.44. But I love Tamarillos. Oh Tamarillo sandwiches. Yum. Right, there's the warehouse. The warehouse is about to lighten my wallet. Can't deal with that. Should I get this for David's Christmas present? Okay, that would be my Christmas present. Let's keep moving. Oh, 
Oh, you see that? Look, look. Oh, is that the sun or is it some kind of UFO? Okay, okay, I spent a gazillion dollars. Actually, I didn't. I didn't do too badly because I spent 80 something, about $86. I may or may not have bought a crunchy bar because I bought it to share with the baby. I bought the birthday present for my friend's one-year-old, about to turn one. I hope it's okay. It's kind of a pull-along toy. And so for one, you don't want anything too complicated. So I thought something nice and bright. Okay. Um, I'm doing a haul in the car. Got slippers. Okay, this time I splurged. I did not buy cheapy little slippers because they were having a half-price sale. So I bought these and they did feel really comfortable but there's good news and bad news they are actually a size too big and they didn't have my size but they were half price so they were down from $40 to 20 bucks and so I'm quite pleased with those and they are a lot more hard wearing than the ones that I've been wearing that have sanitary pads pulling out the back of them they're sheepskin they will be quite nice and cozy in, in winter <laughs> Even if they are a bit big. I'm not sure what my plan is when they stretch. Maybe I'll give them to David. I bought a scrubbing brush. I bought a Christmas present and I'm not sure if I should actually reveal what it actually is. In case the person I bought it for is watching. But I can tell you this is really, really cool. I was so excited when I saw one a few weeks back and I bought one for myself. It's a carpet sweeper and it's totally not electric. You just sweep it along and it picks up. And it's really good for in-between vacuuming. And um, it just tidies things up so nicely. It's really good for unexpected crumbly spills and picking up pet hair. And I just love mine. And I saw it and I thought, yay, I am going to get one for somebody for Christmas. And hopefully they won't work out that it's for them if they happen to be watching as if all my friends watch me. And I bought some milk. I didn't actually buy that much, so I think I got off okay. So, you know, having bought two gifts, I think, was quite good. I bought these, a new flavour of Tic Tac. Lolly. Oh, lollies. I have a lolly mad boy in the back here, but he's chomping on a bit of crunchy bar. And so I thought I'd give these a try, because normally I have the spearmint ones. This would make a good ASMR video for my other channel. Taps, lots of taps. I hate tapping, you know, for an ASMR artist who does not like tapping. That's a little bit weird. I prefer crinkles. I quite find, quite find, I find crinkles quite relaxing. Packaging crinkles. I digress. Okay, now live for the first time, a live tasting of the Tic Tac mixes. Six? No. Okay, let's try that again. That was a bit... I'm blind. Live tasting of the Tic Tac Mixes, a flavor-changing experience. This is coconut to pineapple crush. So it starts off tasting of coconut and then goes to pineapple. Let's give it a go. Did you know this little thing here is a tray to put your Tic Tac on? Huh? Isn't that nifty? I haven't got the patience for that. So I'm going to throw a couple of these in my mouth. Let you know what I think. I should be tasting coconut. It doesn't taste very coconutty to me. It just tastes kind of sweet. Not unpleasant. Yay! Oh, oh, wait does change flavor i'm getting i'm getting a hint of coconut oh so it's gone from a slight hint of coconut to an almost mint it's almost got a mint sort of like coconut toothpaste it's not unpleasant it is a flavor changing experience it's gone from coconut to mint i'm thinking like slightly peppermint It's still tasting a mint to me. I'm not getting any pineapple. Artificial fruit flavour. Oh, look, a truck. It tastes like coconut toothpaste to me. 
Oh, wait. Oh. 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 There's the pineapple. The center of it is slightly softer, but it's not like a hard shell. Okay, so it's like a it's like a coconut mint that like starts off tasting sugary. And then you get a hint of coconut and then you get the mint. And then it starts to get softer Lally. and it's it's all pineapple, man. It's all pineapple. Lally. Okay, all that mint, all that coconut, it's just gone. And it's kind of like a refreshing pineapple. Whoa, it's like being on a tour with Willy Wonka. Flavour changing. How do they do that? What is this magic? Not bad, guys. Is it a breath freshener, though? Like the spearmint Tic Tacs, I've always taken to be a breath freshener. How's my breath? <sighs> is it all right? I've just blabbered on about nothing in particular today, but I have accomplished something. I have bought two presents and I've bought some slippers, so I no longer have to walk around with tampons. Tampons? I no longer have to walk around with sanitary pads on my feet. And I'm going to just tuck into my crunchy bar now. Have you finished yours? All right, there's a little more. Half each now, no more. The rest is mine. It's mine.